Welcome back to Nier Automata. Automata. Um, uh, so I got uh, Automata Pia. We were just talking about games on Steam that never go on fucking sale. I didn't mean to go in there, but I guess I am. Oh, fuck, I am. You gotta press a witch switch. Why didn't you press the witch switch? I didn't care about you killing yourself. You can do that all you want. Oh my god! Oh, it made her googly. Thanks, Josh. Look what you fucking did. Do you need to do that? Yeah, I need to, I need to stomp her eyes in. Oh, I can see the scratches. I hear a cat chittering behind your TV. That's heavy. I can't do it. It's not a human sound. That's the, the fucking predator noises. That's the closest I can get. All right, is that it? No. Did we, did we beat it? No. Nope. God damn it. That's three. So, um, this level sucks dick. No, watch. Oh my god. You've already been in here. Yeah, but I haven't been up here. I don't need that. You see how those golden feathers are leading over here? Okay. Biko's wings. Who's Biko? That's uh, that was that was that's actually an error. That was uh, Kazooie's name in uh, development, but they forgot to change at that time. Oh wow! I'm fucking lying. I know. He's a turd. He keeps calling her bad slur names. Biko is not. Yeah, a, but he fucking dies. So. If, like I'm just saying, if you go to Banjo World, do not call anybody a Biko. Like, it, it's like they they show it in like American. English media here, but like fucking over there, that is not okay. I don't even. I didn't even use it. How did he? What did he say to do? I don't know how to do it. I don't either. <laughs> I wasn't reading. You're too busy talking to me about Biko. I just figured I knew how to do it because uh, right or left trigger and pushing the right stick right. Oh, okay. It's just like the old game. It's like it, like the C stick. I figured it would be a different bind, like they did for the uh, talent trot. You know what? Fuck it. I don't need this. <laughs> That's what I was hoping to happen. Isn't that? They didn't show his final smash, did they? Mm, I don't think they did. I bet it's gonna just be like an area thing where he play Banjo and Kazooie play Kazooie, and then maybe Mumble come in and play... Mumble come play? He play... Mumble come play Xylophone. He play Xylophone, yeah. Mumble come play Violin. Yeah, Dive Fly and Violin. 2D come play Piccolo. Piccolo. <laughs> Number 15. 2D come play Piccolo. <laughs> I love the out of context chills. It, yeah, it's fun. Number three, help me. <laughs> I came across a, 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 I guess somebody like retweeted a, an out of context chills. It was the, it was the psychic pills one. Oh really? Where, where he just says, "I swear to God, if I saw that damn thing in my living room, I'd stomp it into a small brown stain." Number 12, the gamer ghost. I wish Banjo would do this to me. Why? So I can see his feet up close. <laughs> oh, I, I, in Banjo 2, you can grab on ledges. You have to learn how to do it, of course. Sounds like Banjo 2 is a better game than this it's one. It's not a better game. It's one of those games where it's just like. Everything's bigger and more, and like objectively, it should be better, but it's just fucking not. Oh, uh, like Donkey Kong 64? Pretty much, yeah. They just like made huge worlds and then just crammed it full of shit that you didn't need to get. Yeah. Um, That's why I like. I, I don't know. I kind of don't like the hub world of this game. I like it. Like, because like you have to go to one thing, unlock it, then go find the level again. But there's, like, things you can get in the whole world. Yeah, but I'm just not, like... Okay, if I remember this correctly, this is actually bullshit. Yep. You're, you, you, there's no nothing that tells you to do that. Like, it does, there's not, like, an egg switch or anything there. It's just you have to know to hit that with eggs. 
That's not a universal constant in this game. That's not a rule. My, my, also, I think my thing with games like this is, like, I have to collect everything, and that drives me insane. I've... Like, I have this drive yeah. to get everything. This isn't the game that that you want to 100% at the whole game, like, it every time you play it. I've done it once, and that's probably enough for me. So we're just going to play it to beat it. I don't know. I, I'm going to at least try and get all the notes. Because you do have to get, like, a bunch of fucking notes. I think at least 700-something. Where are we at? Uh, 372. Uh, but that get, but that, that's because we've hundred percented like every level. three levels so far. But that gets a lot harder. Yeah. And I, I'm amazed that I was able to do those levels just on autopilot without missing any notes. I don't because I played the first few levels a bunch of times. That's going to be a different story once I get to the levels that I played less. Yeah. I don't even know what the fuck to do right now. Go down? Yeah, I should go down and, uh... Video games, man. My brother's, uh, owned Bloodborne now. Oh, yeah? He beat Dark Souls. Um... There's a G in there. And so now he's on Bloodborne, and he's liking it a lot. He... He's a big fan of all, like, you know, he's only played Dark Souls 1 and Bloodborne, but he likes them. He's gonna play Dark Souls 3 last. I told him save Dark Souls... Or, no, he's gonna play Dark Souls 3 next. I told him save Dark Souls 2 for last. Because, like... If he quit that one, I'm not gonna hold it against him. Because the thing he likes about Dark Souls is, like, the interconnected world. And yeah. the good level design. And I'm like, well... <laughs> well, if you like interconnected world and good level design, let me show you a game you're sure to love. <laughs> Dark Souls 2. I told him, the moment I told him about fucking adaptability, he was like, fuck, that game sounds like shit. I was like, yep. I still, I, I'm still weirded out by Dark Souls 2. Yeah. It has a, a lot of really neat ideas. but it's, I love power stancing. It's punctuated by garbage. Yeah. And I love some of the environments. Yeah. But I also despise some of the environments. Like, I liked uh, Dragon's Area. Yeah. Like, that I, place like, looks I like the Misty Forest area. I, I, I don't see enough of those in games that are, that, like, are really like, nice and nice and foggy. Mm. But of course, if you bring that up to some people, they're just like, oh, they made it foggy because you there's a shadow in that one. You can... You think you're uh, fucking smarter than me? I didn't know if like there was something you, you could you grab. Go, you go above him. Oh. I, yeah, don't uh, like. There are some odd concepts for Dark Souls 2 that I like. Yeah. The the chariot boss, like while not a great boss, was kind of neat. Yeah, it's a neat idea. I need to go over there, I guess. But, like, again, adapt Like, somebody tried to. Um. Well, I, I, I. My mistake, which I don't really care that much, but, like, I made a mistake of commenting and saying something bad about Dark Souls 2 on the Dark Souls 2 subreddit. Yeah, I don't. I can't imagine that going over too well. And I was like, no. I, what, did, what exactly did I say? You said the N word. In reply to somebody said somebody on the subreddit said Dark Souls 2 is the best Souls game. No justification. They just said it is. And then they go, somebody replied, I loved to power stance great swords, but never liked the dodge mechanics. Then I saw that adaptability gave me my precious iframes back and I came to the light. And I replied, Putting points into a stat to get iframes back to where they should be to begin with is why Dark Souls 2 is my least favorite. Did they send you death threats after that? Which I don't think is like... That's not a very I didn't say it's a bad game. Opinion. Yeah, that, that, I said it's my least favorite. That wasn't very inflammatory. Yeah. Some guy literally said, I didn't like this game until I realized they turned the dodge into a level up thing. The thing and I was like, oh, that's what fucking made you go, oh, this was great. They invented a problem and sold you the solution. Yes, exactly. And then, uh, 
<laughs> Some guy said, okay, yeah, but uh, most PvP builds hover at 150 instead of 120 now. It was like, yeah, because they fucking <laughs> raised the goddamn thing and you have to have 30 adaptability to have a, a good build for PvP. I like the part where uh, you're in that area with waist-high water everywhere and there's a bunch of magic enemies shooting stuff at you, but their aggro range is slightly longer than the actual draw distance. <laughs> <laughs> what is that place called? I can't remember. The Swamp of Mayhem. No, it's Cavern of something. That was always a big deal, that area. Everybody, everybody always hated that area. Did they ever fix it? No. Shit. I'm pretty sure Scholar of the First Sin made it worse. Oh god. <laughs> Shrine of Shrine of Amana. Ah, uh, yes. That's what it was called. Um, I was about to look it up, and then I didn't. I... Everybody brings this up, but I, I still love the fact that, uh... The, the, whole, the whole drive for you to, like... Go out and, like, kill these three big bad bosses or whatever... Is because there's some waist-high rubble blocking a small passageway... <laughs> that you could easily climb over... <laughs> The, and the entire thing is just opening like a little gazebo on the side to go around it. <laughs> you gotta have enough souls. <laughs> it's fucked. You don't have to kill them. Really? Your soul memory can be high enough. Oh. We're getting group me's. Is this important? It's just more people confirming Hagen's thing. Oh, okay. Alright, I need eight more notes down in the water. Yeah, they, they might be. But, you know, just you know, shake and make sure. Uh, I Go down to that pipe. I, I did that pipe right there, but these other two I may not have. Um, I beat Arkham City for the second time yesterday. Ooh, how did you feel about it? Remember how you, you, you said you liked Asylum better? Yeah. And I was like, you're fucking... Seriously, dude? Well... <laughs> I don't. I don't dislike City at all. No, I don't either. I. I just think, I think it's almost as good as, as Arkham. But I can see, like, at least my thing is just that there's a lot more in City, and it's just Arkham felt more like an. You mean Asylum? They're both Arkham. I, well, fucking shut up. Um, I, Arkham Asylum felt more like a cut and dry thing. Yeah. Just like you play it, it's done, it's good, it's short, and it's sweet. It's not even that short. You went through the long pipe though. I yep. went through that long pipe. But with Arkham City, it's the gameplay is like just as good with some improvements. Yeah. But there's a lot more going on in there. There's a lot more things to collect, things to do. But I, I'm not the kind of person who always wants to do all those things. Yeah, I don't care for that. It, it became an open world game with a bunch of check check boxes. Um, and the, uh, the 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 city itself just wasn't. It wasn't very uh, I, discernible. I, I, Arkham Knight's on Game Pass, and I'm thinking I might try it. I was about to buy Arkham Knight last night, but I, I figured I'm, I'm not... I'm going to do that thing where I go right into the next game and I quit halfway through. Yeah. So I'm just going to wait for the next sale and see if I want to still play it. Oh, this area. I have not been doing that with the Gears of War series. Snippet mutants are we. Jigsaw is ours. Fight us, you must. Like, I've been playing through the Gears of War series, and, like, I took a break halfway through Gears of War 2, but, like, that was because I thought I was recording that with Duke. I thought we were going to start doing Gears of, like, a Gears of War series. We decided to do another game, but, which he's supposed to edit, but he just left the shit on my computer. I'm not editing that, Duke. Hell yeah. How are they still talking to you when you killed them? They're mutants. I I kind of liked the thing they were going for. Well, it seems like in Arkham City they were going for a whole thing where like they had competing bad guy leaders. Yeah. They had the Penguin, Two Face, and Joker. But then like that never pans out. You you just get rid of Two Face and Penguin, and then Joker is the bad guy again. Yeah. It would be cool if, like, you did you didn't deal like with one of them or something. 
like you were about to go deal with it and Joker does something really fucked up, you know? But I still I still love both of those games. Yeah, I, they're I, great. But I, like I I, I find myself yeah. I find myself replaying Asylum more. I feel like I, I won't be able to I still at this point won't be able to replay Asylum before playing City in order. But I still haven't played Night yet. And I was going to play Origins. I I don't know what it is. I genuinely think it's the not Kevin Conroy that has kept me from playing that. Like his voice is so just like slightly off, and it's yeah. I've seen I've seen it. It sounds like somebody trying to like imitate him, but not very good. Yeah, and so I was just like, oh yeah. yeah. I would just like a different voice, if if anything. Yeah, it's a younger Batman. He doesn't have to sound exactly like Kevin Conroy. What about that one up there? Where? that over there? Is that the one that you shot with eggs? Yeah. Not the one... What's behind you, then? Uh, I got this one. That's the one you shot with eggs. Oh, that's the one where I, cl- where I went on a... I tiptoed across a pipe to get it. Okay. So what the fuck is left? Is there anything in the actual Clanker Cavern part, or do you need to go back to the first part? <laughs> well, uh, we m- if we don't say anything interesting, we might fast forward. Well, I was gonna keep talking. Okay, well, never mind. We're not gonna fast forward. Okay. Um... I. Do you need so, to hit whatever those are? I don't think so. Watch that be a solution. I. Uh, they seem like a thing that you need to do. You can't do anything underwater though. Uh, um, like I wanted to play Arkham Origins, even though I heard it was just not that great, but it's still okay. But then I heard that it was basically Arkham City, but just like an expansion of Arkham City in, in terms of like gameplay. And it's the Joker again. There's nothing new about it. Like they tried to. Trying to like do a black mask thing and it's just fucking Joker. Oh. Well, thanks for spoiling it. It's. I mean, you can tell. Really? Like it's. It's one of those like really. What's in there? Uh. Is it an exit? What is down there? Oh fuck! Oh, the Jinjos is one. He still has a purple Jinjo. Well, where the fuck is he, Josh? It was a blue Jinjo, by the way. But yeah, I, I thought there would be at least something interesting about Arkham Origins, but from what I hear... And and no. it's not Mark Hamill as the Joker. Yeah, it's fucking... Troy Baker. Troy Baker, yeah. And now he's fucking Bruce Banner, and that's like... It just sounds like Troy Baker. And Nolan North as Tony Stark just sounds like... Nolan North. Oh, wait a minute. This pipe right here has something. It has a, a honeycomb, I think. Ah, where am I? But yeah, I've been playing Breath of the Wild again in the hopes that I'll actually fucking do the DLC. Like I've, I've, I had, I've had the DLC for months. I just never did anything with it. Yeah, like, the only DLC that I actually touched was what we did in uh, our failed Let's Play. We didn't. Well, we did Master Mode. Oh. Yeah. I tried Master Mode. I, I, I don't care for it. Honestly, it's not a... Oh, you know, I think, it, I, I, think I did try the, uh, the thing where you do the weird f- paddle thing. You you have you have the, the the weird little weapon that uh it makes you die in one hit and you do uh, something with a trial or something like that. I don't know. I'm gonna do the trial of the sword first thing um, because I am going like I, I'm going straight for the master sword right now. Like I haven't I haven't put a single point into stamina oh. and I'm already at ten hearts. I think. All you gotta do is get a hearty during it. Heal you all the way. Don't worry about heart. No, it's you have to have like a certain amount of hearts. Oh, you're talking about Master Sword. I was yeah. only half listening. Yeah, go back to the beginning area, I guess. This is not the beginning area. This is the reactor. Oh, I know this is the beginning area. There might be a Jinjo in here, but that's still that's not the last one. I don't think. Yes, it is. Nope. There's still one more. Right. That's the last Jinjo. Oh. I, I was talking about the judge. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, oh. we need silence. 
I don't hear one. Where do they go? Like, help me! They go like, help! Help! In uh, Banjo Tooie, they there's actually a, a, a variant of a, of Jinjos called Minjos. I'm not kidding. <laughs> and and as soon as you go, yeah, fuck you. They, they, as soon as you go up to them, they turn evil and start chasing you. <laughs> go on, chase you, Minjos. <laughs> All right, I don't think there's a Minjo in, or Jinjo in here. That's fucking hilarious. Did you get in the pipe? Underwater through one of the pipes to the left of Clanker. Yes. Raise Clanker. Defeat yes. the Mutie Snippets. Yes. Behind the grate. Which grate? Inside Clanker's mouth, fire three blue eggs into the gold tooth on Clanker's right side. That one right there. This is the one I, I chose not to do. No! So moving the camera while ducking is not an option anymore, I guess. You dick, come on. This this is it, though. So it's just that and the last Jinjo, which is the blue one, I think. Yeah. Alright, I know where the blue Jinjo is. Okay. See, I didn't think this this one would give me a Jiggy. I thought this was just another way to get in. Because there's two on There's one on each side. Two thick. Is it inside? No. Okay. Inside a two-way pipe on the wall to Clanker's right. So, that was side. Inside a two-way pipe. So, down there, that pipe right there. This one right here? I, I thought I've been in all these. Oh, I hear him. Yep. Alright, we're done. We gotta get them. I know. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna get it. We're gonna get it, and then uh, next time on. Took you 37 minutes to do that. God damn. Well, we. I mean, we. We, we, we went out and ate lunch between. before last episode and left the game paused. Yeah, that's what it was. Next time on. That, uh. Uh, 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 uh,